Hi, this is Jason from the Photoshop Kitchen with a Photoshop Kitchen a la carte quick tip. I'm working with an image from fine art photographer John Francois O'Kane. And as you can see, lots of detail here. This thing actually looks like a painting, which uh, it's very impressive. And it's actually, it actually starts out as a photo right there. And John Francois is able to transform it through use of a few Graphic Authority products into something that really resembles a, a almost like a fine art oil painting. And I'm going to attempt to replicate what he has done by opening up a template from Graphic Authority. This is from the Graphic Choice series. And I'm going to drop in this photo of a basketball player. I'm simply going to do a drag and drop while holding shift into my layout and that was was very quick, very easy and took me almost exactly where I want to go with this. Now, I've not yet applied the clipping mask. My photo is sitting above the Your Photo Here layer, so I'm simply going to grab that, drag it down underneath Your Photo Here turn off the visibility of the Your Photo Here layer, or I could simply grab that, take it to the trash can and get rid of it all together. I'll go ahead and hit Command or Control Z and bring that layer back in, but uh, certainly that is something that could be removed without any trouble. So again, turn off all other, all other visibility, turn on all of the layers which are included in the template from Graphic Authority, and the real secret is in this overlay color really gives it that painterly effect. But less than 30 seconds time, drag and drop, very simple. For templates and other tools, remember to go to graphicauthority.com, the Photoshop professional's choice for photo edges, frames, brushes, and backgrounds.